A snowmobile driveline consists of four principal components. The engine, a continuously variable transmission, a secondary chain drive system, and the track and suspension. A snowmobile's rear suspension must be included in any discussion of the powertrain as it plays a vital role in assisting the track in delivering power to the ground. In a snowmobile, torque is transmitted from the engine to the CVT's primary clutch, through the drive belt to the CVT's secondary clutch. The secondary clutch is attached to and also drives a countershaft. The countershaft drives the secondary chain drive system's drive sprocket, which transmits power through a chain to the chain drive's driven sprocket. The driven sprocket transmits power to the track drive axle shaft. From the axle shaft, power is transmitted to the track drive sprockets and to the track itself. Engine torque is then conveyed along the track to the suspension, close to the rear axle, to produce forward traction. It is important to recognize that a snowmobile suspension system is not merely a means of providing good ride characteristics. It's also an essential part of the drivetrain. Without a carefully designed and adequately adjusted suspension system, much of the power produced by the engine would never reach the ground.